picture. This time I want to bring you to different places. I took uh, pictures at a place which is called Elvis Tunnel. It's also not very known. It's a um, small place in a small place <laughs> which is called Elneswagen. I also have been on a place which is called Fachstadtsanden and if you translate it into English then it would be the beach of Fachstad. which you can see from Elnes Tangen or from many other places in uh, Elnes Wong or Fiena. Uh, it is pyramid shaped and uh, that makes it a landmark so it have, has a, like it can be very easily recognized from afar off so everybody can know about it those locals who live here uh, yeah. it's very remarkable and uh, I think this one is very photogenic and I tried to capture it a couple of times and also yesterday I tried to capture it um, that was my plan for the day actually to take a nice picture of that mountain um, it was also very grayish cloudy which is not necessarily bad, but um, the grey weather can can make a picture look very boring at times. Not always. I try, of course, to edit my pictures as good as I can and as appealing as I can. Uh, but not always it works out as I have imagined, to say that way. nasty weather out here, it's raining, it's cold and it's windy and uh, I wanted to take a picture of that mountain here, it's called uh, Yandam's Fjell, the mountain of Yandam and I'm at, uh, behind me, that city or that light you see, that's called uh, Elneswagen and uh, it's maybe half an hour away from uh, from uh, Molde and about the same amount of time half an hour from uh, the Atlantic Ocean Road yeah but I came to take a picture of that pyramid kind of shape that pyramid shape of mountain yeah I already took a long exposure picture about uh, one and a half minutes or so. It was still two hours. Okay, the uh, camera is not blowing away. The problem was I did it in uh, that direction there, and uh, yeah, sorry, it was too much wind. Sorry that I uh, I had to turn off the camera when I was talking before because there was too much uh, wind, kind of a little storm or whatever you want to call it. Uh, so now it's a little bit better. The the light is extremely beautiful. I can try to uh, to 
to uh, show you that. I'm not sure if that's possible. Yeah, it looks basically grey here. The mountain is definitely that what I want to take a picture of. I already tried it. From another perspective here is that uh, nasty pole. Where is it? There. No, there. This pole in the water which uh, makes the picture a little bit ugly. I'm pretty sure I will uh, clone it out. So this is a um, place where you can have barbecue and enjoy the view. Here's my camera. And right now I do take a picture in that direction. With that tree, those dark rocks in the foreground, and the water, those mountains will be in that picture, but not the Yendam's shield that doesn't fit in there. That one will probably become a very uh, contrasty picture, very dark, and uh, yeah, will be good. Let's see. Light is still extremely nice. It's almost 10 a.m. in the morning. Uh, to be precise, it's 9:48 a.m. It's just beautiful out here. It's raining. It's windy. It's stormy and cold. But the light and the landscape is totally worth it to come out of here. Out here. I also have been on a place which is called Fahrstadt Sanden and if you translate it into English then it would be the beach of Fahrstadt a very nice place where you can take many different kind of pictures I will show you some uh, which I have taken today so today is Wednesday and I plan to finish that video on Friday um, so Fahrstadt Sanden is a very long beach, it is um, more like a bay and uh, you have that half round beach. Um, it is very stretched, on the one side you have a farm and that farm has a little boathouse and uh, it is very very photogenic, this little boathouse with a uh, beach. And, uh, with the background and the water and everything that you can see there. And um, on the other side, if you turn around and you look into the other side, then you see those this massive mountain, uh, which is also very beautiful to see and to watch. And it's called Stem Sesten. And don't ask me what that means in English. I have no clue. Um, yeah. It's very beautiful to take pictures of that beach combined with with the water and that mountain in the background, which is a very can give a very nice composition if you do it right. Today I took some pictures of it um, where I tried to reflect the mountain into in, in the water, which uh, was like swapping over the beach. I think I will try to go somewhere down to the beach and try to get that mountain uh, with like a reflection of that mountain inclusive that mountain into one picture. I don't know if I totally understandable. Whatever, you will see it. In the foreground you have this beautiful pattern, leading lines, uh, so I try to compose a picture with those leading lines, the cabin, the beach and the water all together.
So, uh, I guess I'm done for today here at Elnes Tang. Um, if you want to, if you want to come here, if you think it's a great location for taking pictures, which I personally believe, if you are like landscape photography, and uh, I think this mountain is very remarkable. It's uh, iconic and uh, definitely worth uh, taking pictures of. So if you want to come here, I will leave a link somewhere up here. I believe it's on that side, not on that side. You will see. I guess it's here on that side. There you will find uh, a link to to uh, Google Maps where I will where I will link to the parking place where you can park. The place where I am now is um, a path you have to go. I guess about one between one and two kilometers, and uh, you will uh, come directly to that place here. There's this little uh, barbecue place with some benches, a little hut, and uh, this great view, of course. So, if you liked that video, then uh, please give me a thumb up. That would help me a lot. If you didn't like that video, you are very welcome to give me down that's totally fine for me and uh, please consider to subscribe if if you like that video and if you want to see more of, of what i do i will definitely post more videos in the future yes thank you for taking the time to watch it up to that point i wish you a good day and god bless